This information is provided for public education purposes only and is not intended to substitute for a manufacturer's directions or consultation with a licensed pharmacist or healthcare professional. All medication, including those available over the counter, can be harmful if not used as directed and taking more than one medication could result in harmful drug interactions. Please consult a licensed pharmacist or healthcare professional before taking any medication or changing an already approved or prescribed medication plan. Hello, my name is Miriam and I'm a student pharmacist at the University of Arkansas for Medical Sciences. Today, I'm here to talk to you about your medication, Hyosiamine. Hyosiamine is also known as the brand names Anispaz, Levzin, Cymax, and Levbid. Hyosiamine comes in an oral elixir, oral solution, tablet, dispersible tablet, extended release tablet, and a sublingual tablet. Hyosiamine can be used for a variety of different medical conditions. The most common uses are to treat diarrhea, irritable bowel syndrome, Parkinson's disease, and also to slow the speed of the digestive system and for muscle spasms in the digestive system and urinary system. Hyosiamine is usually taken by mouth anywhere from three to six times a day, depending on your condition. It is recommended that you take hyosiamine 30 minutes to an hour before eating, but it is not required. With the many forms hyosiamine comes in, check with your pharmacist on how to best take your medication and ask your pharmacist before crushing, chewing, or breaking the tablets. It is important to not take antacids at the same time as they might affect how hyosiamine works in your body. Some common side effects with hyosiamine include dry mouth, flushing, dizziness, drowsiness, confusion, and excitement. These effects may be worse in elderly patients. Some less common side effects include headache, diarrhea, nausea and vomiting, and increased heart rate. While taking hyosiamine, Remember, it is important to tell your doctor or pharmacist if you have signs of an allergic reaction, such as rash, itching, swelling, tightness of the chest, if you have any of these health problems, bowel blockage, enlarged colon, glaucoma, heart problems, myasthenia gravis, ulcerative colitis, trouble urinating, or have had a heart attack, or if you are over the age of 65. Thank you for watching, and if you have any further questions, please contact your pharmacist or healthcare provider. This information is provided for public education purposes only and is not intended to substitute for a manufacturer's directions or consultation with a licensed pharmacist or healthcare professional. All medication, including those available over the counter, can be harmful if not used as directed and taking more than one medication could result in harmful drug interactions. Please consult a licensed pharmacist or healthcare professional before taking any medication or changing an already approved or prescribed medication plan.